gentlemen, please welcome to the stage your first comic of the evening, a very, very funny man, Mr. Wesley King! Yeah! Oh! Thank you, everyone. Thank you for the warm welcome. I appreciate all the clapping. I usually don't accept the clap from anyone I don't know. Uh, <laughs> but I like you guys, so let's just get on with this. Um, as CJ said, um, my name is Wesley King, or I don't know if he said that, but my name is Wesley King. But my good friends call me Mr. Benefits because I manage all of their 401ks and passive income. <laughs> and I also have casual sex with each and every one of them. <laughs> A lot of guys. <laughs> but seriously though, speaking of uh, money and saving money and not spending what you don't have, I suggest you do something I've done, which is um, take your most awkward, ugly middle school photo and customize your credit card with it. <laughs> Put it right on the front. You'll never ever take your wallet out and spend money you don't have. <laughs> In middle school, I looked like an alien. <laughs> I looked very odd. Uh, it was very hard for me to get someone to go out on a date with me. These days, it's not as hard. I get most of my dates from Craigslist, actually. I'm really a fan of their new casual encounters of the third kind section. <laughs> my most recent post has garnered some attention intergalactically. It says, cute but shy, adventurous millennial. <laughs> Earthling. <laughs> Seeks fun loving, fat soluble woman type creature to gaze at the stars with. No piercings, please, and prefer extensive black hole experience. <laughs> <laughs> and I actually found someone. She was gonna be here tonight, but apparently Jesus had reserved her wormhole that she usually is. Oh, <laughs> it's alright, that means our relationship is in the right place. <laughs> Jesus first. <laughs>
and try and try again. That is not a good joke, I know. But it fits in six different things. Marital sex, sex toys, erectile dysfunction, Beyonce, Aaliyah, and cooking spaghetti. So I gotta give it a try. There are two, no, no, there's a lot of things wrong or like observational things with reality that just are fucked up, but I brought you two tonight, um, kind of sad things. Um, first is that the easiest way, or the best way not to get a girl pregnant is to only have sex with friends. <laughs> the second thing, which is kind of sad as well, is a double-sided dildo connects people way better than social media ever will. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, really quick, here's my last joke. I used to have my Twitter and my LinkedIn connected. For those of you who don't have LinkedIn, I'm sorry you're unemployed. <laughs> but I'll explain the joke to the rest of you guys. So every time I posted uh, something on Twitter, it would go directly to my LinkedIn, which is fine, until one day a coworker came up to me in the break room and said, Ha, Wes, you're a funny guy. Uh, two in the pink, one in the stink, am I right? <laughs> so I threw him up against the wall. I said, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I would never post that cliche shit on Twitter. I would say one on the clit, two in the pit, or two in the suit, and one in the poop. Thank you. Happy birthday, Wesley!